let's talk about how to have an epic Amazon launch. I've launched about 13 products now, all different types of crafting supplies, some off Amazon, some on Amazon, some on TikTok. But there was one thing that I found to be true, that if I do every product launch, we're most likely to have success. But what does success look like? In my opinion, success is when you sell out, you get some sort of badge on Amazon and you actually have people buy your product and it really jump starts the flywheel. That's what success looks like on a launch. Because if you were to simply list your products on Amazon and just let them be, they will eventually sell, eventually. But it might take six months for that to happen. And that's because there's this flywheel. At least that's how I like to describe it. And it takes a lot of effort and energy to get it turning. Amazon will not take you seriously until you start to get sales and reviews. They're just not going to show your product to a lot of people. In fact, you're not even going to be able to find it when you're searching on Amazon. It will be suppressed until the sales start to come in. You can give it time or you can jumpstart that process by doing a few key things. That's what I want to talk about today because these are things that I'm going to be doing again soon to launch the matte version of our Maker's Magic. I'm going to be building a launch list so I can jumpstart the flywheel on Amazon. So what does that look like? What can we do to ensure success? What we're looking for is attention. So our goal is to capture that attention over a period of time and then have everybody rush to buy the product as soon as it's live and you're ready to begin taking sales. This will help you get early reviews. This will help you get early sales. It will also help you build momentum much faster than if you don't. And trust me, I've done both. I've done it all. And because of what I've learned, we now only launch products once a quarter because I don't have enough attention to continuously launch more. I want them to be effective. I also like to put time, effort, and consideration into the products that we're launching. So this year in 2024, we plan to launch three. And we've been developing and working on them all year last year. So it's finally coming to a head. We have a matte version of our Maker's Magic. We have a Scorch Paint. And then we are relaunching an ornament kit. It's Christmas. We're just going to do it on time this time. So how do we have a successful launch? We need to build a list. At least that's what I like to do. And I know that might sound daunting or confusing or different than what we're used to, but it really is quite simple. We need to build a list of interested people, people that are interested in our product and want to make a purchase, people who want it. So how do we do that? I like to use a Google form. You can use Jot form. You can use a Google form. You can use a landing page from Clavio or ConvertKit or MailChimp, we need a way to capture their email address. Why? So we can email them when we go live. So let me break down the strategy for Scorchmarker and what works so well to have a launch where we sold out and got number one new release and best selling badges on Amazon. The first thing that we did was we put a link in our bio on all of our social media accounts, Instagram, Facebook, TikTok, YouTube, and that link in our bio was a link and if they clicked on it it would bring you to a google form they said get notified when maker's magic goes live name email that's it and then i made videos i made so many videos i would just make videos talking about this stuff and why it was important to me and what our plan was and what we were doing i would test it on things i would experiment with it i would try and break it or freeze it or burn it and just have fun i was just having fun i was just being real showing people behind the scenes. And eventually we would get comments. Occasionally people would ask, how can I get some? When does it release? When's it coming out? And I would video reply. Sometimes people would say, I don't even know what this is. What are you talking about? I'd video reply to comments. Some people would just talk shit and I would video reply to the comments. And what it did is it started to build momentum, interest, and hype around this product. Now I started doing this about a month before we were able to sell it. So I had about four weeks to make videos. And in that four weeks, I put 3,000 people on a list. 3,000 people put in their email and were like, I want to know when this goes live. I want to know. So we just kept making videos and telling people to sign up, get on the email list. Sometimes we would to use the link in our profile, but occasionally you don't want to use that language. They just platforms don't like it that much. So we started building this list, right? And then we would start to nurture this list a little bit. Hey, 10 more days. It's coming. We're almost there. Hey, five more days. It's coming. We're almost there. Hey, look how cool this turned out. We used it for this product. Three more days, we're almost there. And on launch day, when Amazon was ready to take sales for Maker's Magic, we sent an email to the entire list and we said, it's here, it's time. And we just simply served up an Amazon link. Now it, it was an attribution link. So we used an 
affiliate link that we built on Amazon through the ads platform so we could see attribution or how many people clicked through and made the purchase so we could test how effective things were. We didn't need to do that because I can tell you right now, it was incredibly effective. We sold out in two hours. In two hours, all the product was gone and people couldn't get it. They were frustrated. They were a little bummed out, but I was loving it. I was loving it because that scarcity creates demand. And when I look at our Amazon listing and I jumped up to like, 200 plus sold in the last day. Oh man, it was great. And we got number one new release in our category and a bestseller badge, all because we took the time to build a list prior to launching this product. I believe this to be a tried and true strategy. If you're anything like me, business banking can feel intimidating and overwhelming. That's why this video is sponsored by Relay, a business banking platform that's better than all the others. Why do I say it's better? Because I use it, I love it. And it's way better than all the other big name banks that I've used. They do everything I need a bank account to do. Multiple accounts, no problem. Send checks, easy. Pay yourself, statements, connect to QuickBooks Online, all of it. It's taken me years to find a banking partner like Relay. So I reached out to them. I asked them if we could work together to sponsor this video because I enjoy and use their products so much. And I know that if I spread the word to you, there's a chance you'll get to experience what I've experienced. Stress-free online business banking. The setup is super easy and can be completed from your computer at home. All you need is your LLC paperwork and your EIN. After a short application process, you're done. There's no monthly fees. There's no monthly minimums. There's no account minimums. There's no minimum balances. There's no hidden fees. Big thanks to Relay for sponsoring this video. I'll leave an affiliate link in the description so you can get set up with your very own business bank account from the comfort of your home. Now you don't have to build a list just via email. I think it's the best way to do it because those are the only people that will actually see your message when you send it out. So there's a couple different ways to build a list. You can do it on email. You can do it in like a private group. You can do it in a text group, but make sure you do it in a method where you have at least one way communication to them and make sure that you're able to send everybody the link. That's what's really important. So just building followers is not good enough because when you post that video, not everybody's going to see it. So we want something more specific, something like a group chat or something like an email list. I think email is the best personally. Everybody uses it. Text can work too. If you want to do a text group, get their phone number, but I still think email is better. Another thing I want to bring up is that Amazon really values this outside traffic. Amazon wants people to stay on the app. They want people shopping. They want people on amazon.com or on the Amazon app. When you send people attention and eyeballs to the Amazon app from outside or off Amazon, it values that traffic. It values those people more than it normally would. So Amazon basically says, oh, this listing is getting a lot of outside traffic. There must be something here. This must be a good product because people are buying it and they're buying it quickly. The velocity's there. Let's show it to more people. And that is how the flywheel starts. Because you took the time to build a list and send outside traffic, you prove to Amazon that they don't need to put you through this six month waiting period to make sure that you're legit. You proved it in the very beginning, and now you don't have to wait. It's a really special thing. It's not terribly difficult either. The content creation side can be challenging, but if you look back at some of the videos that I did, I was just talking to the camera in my garage, posting video replying to comments. It's very simple stuff. I was associating my face with the company and using that as a way to build relationships. I believe that if you have product launches coming up, that this strategy is crucial. It's crucial. You got to do it, especially if you're launching on Amazon. I think it is most important if you're launching on Amazon. Shopify, yes. TikTok shop, yes. But Amazon, it really makes a huge difference. And all you got to do is put in a little work every day ahead of time to build that list. It's much easier too if you already have a list of customers who enjoy your products and love buying from you. You can simply email your previous customers. Hey, we just launched. We're live on Amazon. New product, canine joint supplement. A lot of ways to do this. But I wanted to share my experience with you so that you could take advantage of it for the next time you launch on Amazon. You got this. I hope this makes things clear for a lot of people who have intentions to put their products on Amazon or who are going to launch new products this year or maybe even next. Build the list. It is highly effective. Let's talk about our sales numbers as promised. Now, this is for the last 30 days, as you know, and we're coming off Q4 and we had a retail check hit in the last part of December. But nonetheless, this is how much money we made in the last 30 days. Scorch marker retail $19,000. We 
Got paid by Hobby Lobby. Shopify, $51,287. Our conversion rate was 0.95%. Can't wait to improve that. I'm actually working on it today. Amazon, $121,900 at a 13% conversion rate for the last 30 days. These numbers are as of January 20th to give you some context. I share these for the ones that get inspired, and I hope that's you. I'd love to help you get there too. If you like this video, there's a lot more where that came from. I have put together some incredible trainings, frameworks, scripts, and everything else you might need to make content effortless so you can have more followers and make more sales, just like these members right here. Click the link below and you'll have instant access to everything. I'll see you on the new members call.